I'm, I'm just wondering, um, with the racism that uh, Saka, Sancho and uh, Rashford received oh. after mm. taking their, their unfortunate mispens, um, do you agree uh, that that's that Pretty Patel got it wrong when she labels labels their protest as a merely gesture politics with almost no merit. merit. Okay, so this was uh, Pretty Patel suggesting that taking the knee had become gesture politics. Quasi Quarting. I think, uh, with regard to taking the knee, people should be allowed to express their views. I think what Pretty Patel was saying was that it's not necessarily something that she would do, and when she says gesture politics uh, i don't know what the phrase uh, what phrase she came up with but it is a gesture i mean it's it's something that isn't actually going to affect uh, people's daily experience um and and i think that was the, the point she was making i think what is completely reprehensible is firstly the, the racist abuse which is a scandal frankly in this day and age uh, and the fact that they're allowed to do that on social media um and the other thing is that you know people from all sides try and politicize uh, these issues, and I think that's really regrettable. Did um, Pretty Patel stoke the fires? No, I don't think she did. I mean, if you look at, uh, fo- and I've been following football for you know the, the the 80s when I was a kid, and you know people used to throw bananas at black players and all of that kind of thing. So there's always been a- an ugly element to this. I don't think uh, Pretty Patel caused that. I think it's been in the game, regrettably, for many decades, and a lot of these trolls. Um, I, I probably weren't listening to what Priti Patel was saying. They they had their views, and they expressed their ugly opinions uh, in the way we all know. And would you take the knee? No, I wouldn't. Uh, I wouldn't because I think it is uh, a gesture. And I'm much more, I've always been in my career, someone focused on actual outcomes. I want to do things. I want to uh, change actual things. But I, I, I totally respect people's right to do that. And, and, and you don't because you, you, you just think... It's not actually attacking the issue. Is, it's, is not, what? it's not addressing the issue. I think, and a lot of people, I'm not saying everybody, but a lot of people, and you see this in some companies, they, they kind of go through the motions, so they say the right things, um, but their mindset is, hasn't changed. And I think what you've So got it's a to, sticking plaster in a sense, really, on a problem. Yeah, and it's a, it's a way of saying that I share your pain, but you don't, you're not actually thinking about the issue and how you can change you know, people's racial attitudes, uh, combat prejudice. So I've always had the view that I'm, I'm much more action orientated. But again, I, 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 don't, I don't disrespect or, or, or call people names who do that. If they choose to do that, that's up to them. And, and allowing, they shouldn't be booed. They shouldn't be booed. Uh, and I've always been against that.